Welcome to CBIT uh, 2008 in Hanover, Germany. Um, tell me a little bit why you're at CBIT Hanover. Well, I'm with NICTA, which is Australia's largest ICT centre dedicated to um, ICT research. Uh, we have a lot of exciting research going on, but uh, we like to have some use inspiration for our research. And the best place to get that use inspiration to see where the, where the industry is going is to come to the world's largest fair in that area where you get all of the companies, uh, the leading companies in the world attending, uh, presenting their current products and then uh, showing us what they see in the future, both in the short term and many companies in the long term. Um, and not just the companies, but also um, Europe's leading research organisations also come to, to uh, uh, the CBIT Fair. And we get to look at what they're actually doing in their research labs and what they're showcasing and the directions they're heading in. Great. And um, tell me, what are the, uh, the leading research uh, entities and, and the leading projects in research in Australia? Well, I said we're doing lots of innovative stuff, but the, the area that we're really uh, enthusiastic about at the moment especially is in uh, um, embedded systems. You know, embedded systems are involved in pretty well every part of uh, every device that you deal with. Um, many applications have computers embedded in them. And that area of technology is one that um, Australia has a lot of strength in and that we're pushing ahead with uh, major projects in. Great, and uh, since you've been at CBIT uh, Hanover 2008 and previous years, um, what was, with, with the meetings that you've had so far, what have been some of the outcomes that have come out of those? I think the biggest outcomes are the connections we've got with the leading companies in Europe. Um, and those are heading for us towards joint projects, companies like SAP, um, certainly with the research organisations, the Fraunhofer Institutes, uh, we've got substantial engagement with those organisations. And do you see uh, Australia partnering uh, further into the European framework? Oh, absolutely. I mean, we've already started a couple of projects in the under the seventh framework program, and uh, we're looking to develop more projects, large integrated projects, in the coming years. And uh, so. In, in that framework program and uh, your participation here at, at CBIT Hanover, how do you see that will also bring benefit back to Australia and the future of that region? Well, I reckon the primary goal here and the primary benefit for us is to get connections to markets, right? to really understand what the market drivers are, what the use inspiration is in these things. Uh, you get channels to market for your, for your um, uh, research, and you get the opportunities to actually partner in areas where you don't have skills yourself so that producing solutions to complex problems and to um, produce products that require technologies that you don't have um, is best done by partnering and you can produce complete solutions and we, we think that's going to be the benefit for us. Great, and do you see, um, uh, do you see technologies that are in Australia uh, that aren't here and that um, you are going to bring to market into, uh, into play here into the future? Well, we are involved in research at the moment that we believe will develop technologies that, are, that will be unique, um, be step changes in what we know and, and what we're able to do in terms of technology. Uh, and we believe that we'll be able to provide those as complementary um, technologies to what's available in Europe.